So this is, um, well, it's a useless machine, except it can't even fulfill its purpose of being a useless machine, which makes it an extra useless machine. Um, it also was going to be a rechargeable useless machine, which I just thought was slightly amusing, and I have a thing for rechargeable batteries. Um, in case you didn't know that. I don't think I've built a project that is battery powered that doesn't use rechargeable batteries um, within the last, like, pretty much forever. I mean, there was a time where I was building electronic kits that use disposable batteries, but that was a long time ago before I was, you know, designing my own projects. Um, and now if I were to build a kit that used non-rechargeable batteries, I would just modify it to use... Um, you use a lithium ion because it's what I do. Um, but this is a 3D printed useless machine. Um, the case was downloaded from Thingiverse. Um, so it's not my design. It is someone else's design. Um, I'm actually going to grab a screwdriver. I thought I had one right here and I don't. So anyways, the case is not my design, it's, um, which, I mean, the person who designed this, I, I don't want to be too hard on them, but they kind of did an awful job, because the hatch doesn't close all the way. Um, it's, I mean, it's not that bad, it's better than I could do first try, but I just figured... Because I, I would use a reputable design on Thingiverse because I wanted everything to line up and fit properly, which it um, doesn't because, yeah. And this was the number one used design on Thingiverse, which should tell you something. Um, mostly that um, Thingiverse designs aren't always reliable. Because it really doesn't fit together very well, as you saw. Um, the switch, the, the, the lever misses the switch. And I tried to extend the switch using Suguru, um, which is that white stuff I threw somewhere. Um, and that didn't work at all. But here's the inside. This is a protected 400 milliamp hour um, lithium ion cell. We have a limit switch here. We have a geared uh, DC motor here, and then we have the um, double throw, double pull uh, toggle switch, which is used to reverse the direction of the motor. So right now the motor is in the direction that puts it towards the limit switch, and once it hits the limit switch, it breaks the circuit and stops going backward, and then when I flip it this way, the switch goes forward, and then when I flip it the other way, it goes back until it hits the limit switch, and well, that stops it. Um, I mean, th this was just going to be a quick project, I wasn't even sure if I would make a video about it, but now I am, mostly because it was a complete and utter failure, um, due to the, um, somewhat poorly designed case, and I can't completely blame it on the case, the, um, I, I can blame this on the case, this, this not closing properly, that's totally their fault, because I use their recommended motor, um, so it's not like my motor has the shaft in a different place, it's, that it's designed crappily, um, but the, 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 this here, where it doesn't actually hit the switch, um, I used a different switch than they recommended, because they recommended a switch from Radio Shack. Radio Shack no longer produces because they are super bankrupt. Um, so I, I bought a uh, switch off AliExpress, and well, I bought a lot of switches off AliExpress because you know AliExpress you buy in bulk. Um, and well, um, it's too short. The, the the switch is too short, as you can see. So, uh, now I have a useless machine that can't even fulfill its purpose of being useless. Which is quite something. Um, and I've wasted your time for five minutes with a useless machine that can't even fulfill its purpose of being useless, so I won't waste any more.
Um, this was just meant to be a quick video. Um, and I'll put a link to the Thingiverse page if I remember to, if you want to try to build one of these, and hopefully you have better luck. Um, we'll, we'll, we'll see. I, I do still want to get this working in the end, but it could be a while because I don't care that much because it's a useless machine. And, well, I might need a different switch or whatever. So, that, that's all for now. Bye.